How's it going, you outlaw legends? I'm Red Nitrate, and welcome to my Red Dead Redemption 2 gameplay walkthrough part 43. So on the last episode, we got to finish up the Jim Boy Callaway Gunslinger Stranger Mission, which we started all the way back in Chapter 2. We finally got the new parts available to us, and yeah, we got to finish it off, so... Definitely go check it out if you haven't seen it already. It uh, was quite the unexpected ending, to say the least. Uh, but as for today, got a mission with old boy Dutchie, Country Pursuits. So, um, let's go see what that's all about, shall we? Got a bit of a weird mission start. Out, um, is it out on the balcony? Whereabouts is it? In here? Yeah, out on the balcony. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on, so, Dutchy my lad? Arthur, you get the deciding vote. Well, what? Um? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. Now he comes to that realization. Place, leave this country? <laughs> we need that money. I just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Before the year is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes into heat. Oh, for God's sake, mate, let Farmers. go of the tea thing. <laughs> but we need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. <laughs> Trust me. Arthur. If it's Do you believe in the mango harvest? Business is business. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Yeah. Arthur, come on. You have to agree with Hosea on this one. I am. You know that he's not. I mean... I've heard that before, <laughs> and usually I've been right. Uh, if you say so. Quit doubting, Arthur. It does no favors. Well, mate, we've already come pissed on. off we Angelo Bronte enough. That's boat. why he set us up. With that um, trolley station robbery. To a settlement called Legra. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why Never knows when to bloody boat? quit, does Dutch? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp, catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See. I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. You all right, girl? Uh, well, that remains to be seen, Dodge. Yeah. Okay, follow me. <laughs> Guess we've got no choice but to follow this mad lad in, into the next crazy drama. Thank you. For what? For taking my side back there. No, I'm not and taking your side, side, man. It's just. This is the way the game's pulling me. <laughs> I think you completely lost your marbles. Move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Neither. What does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in Sand and in his back pocket. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young. Jack. Yeah, well, that's why we might want to just cool it and sand a knee, man. <laughs> Stirred up a lot of trouble. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 people, let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? <laughs> Tell me, Arthur. Is it... Have some goddamn faith. Have some faith in the mangoes, damn it. To make a future for us. I know, but what? What? 
But when did you become so small minded? When you started getting us all killed, bro, I think family? it's being realistic. Ways? Just tell me. <laughs> God Is damn. This prison camp? I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. There simply isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. Just feels like we're on borrowed time again. Mm -hmm. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Yeah. We need to move. And soon. Haven't I made that clear? I feel like I'm going in circles with all of you. Micah is the only one left with any loyalty. Now, <laughs> Micah, say, Mike. You, are talking like you really have cracked it, haven't you? That woman is poisoning him against me. I've seen it before. <laughs> What's the problem here? There ain't a problem. You think Micah would question going after Bronte? No. He'd say, let's go. Whoa. Anyway, here we are. Maybe just Let stop worrying about uh, <laughs> about what Micah thinks. And start worrying about uh, some of the more level-headed members of the gang. <laughs> and Thomas, their lowering opinions of you, Dutch. see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's going to help us get close to our prey. The other night we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend. Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. <laughs> exactly. We need to make a... Didn't even need to say a word. He knew exactly what he thought of it. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. If anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you bringing him trouble, there won't be no trouble for me. <laughs> Good. Made a few enemies then, no surprise there. Gift. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Well, I don't know, man. I think it's going to be gators. It take too long if we can find it. I'm not really down with gators. He lied. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big That's what I'm saying, man. Why are we out here then? <laughs> Let's go back inside. Chill. Reptile to scare you, Shirley. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth. That's <laughs> Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas. More of a jester. What are you doing, chicken? Get out of here. <laughs> well, if you say so, Mr. Dutch. No place for chickens. This way. Come on, this way. I'm gonna get eaten alive by a gator. Stay on the high ground. You call this ground? It feels like water to me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. I was gonna say, whinge more, bro, eh? <laughs> got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. Alright, guess we're going with him. Lovely. Gonna get my butt bit by a gator. Check the traps a Gonna bleed out in the bayou. Nada. This one's empty. Zip. Right. I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Yeah, Judge, mate. Well, you show you the right <laughs> one dragging me out here. Oh, he's much more the kind Better it go you than me. <laughs> Stay close. Make sure you follow my line. Oh, I fully intend to. <laughs> yeah, I ain't straying from the pack. No way, no how. You see why evening swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? <laughs> I love it out here. Peaceful. Nobody bothering you none. Except for the night folk sometimes. The night folk? Yep, some strange people around these parts. Oh, those are those people that don't talk and well, attack you in the middle of the night. Better. All sorts of creepy setups, nah. Don't want no night folk, fam. I'll take the I'll even take the gators over the night folk, I'm just gonna be real. They creep me the hell out. <laughs> Whoa. 
Bob, where you are? It's a gator. Just oh, stay I'm quite stay sure that it is. Out in the middle of the swamp and like midnight, man. It's gonna be bloody everywhere. <laughs> Those sounds are very unsettling. I think we are all equally keen to find him. Yeah, well, I mean, I am, I guess. Mainly just so we can get the hell out of this swamp <laughs> as soon as bloody possible. The sooner we find him, the sooner we can go home. Trap stuck in the mud. It happens. Uh, uh, yes. I will do this thing you say. <laughs> Been torn to shreds. Something didn't want to be caught. <laughs> My God. So it's true. What well, is true? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. Mm, I guess this was right. No, but only some huge could do this. <laughs> Big old bull gator, ladies and gentlemen. Fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. <laughs> Should we just keep moving? Bloody really right in the firing line on. for it as well. I suppose this can wait. This Told you I was going to get my butt bit by a gator. I feel it in my bones. Noises are creeping me the hell out. Could do without that in my life. Oh lord. Nah, that's cool. So we're heading back, eh? My God, there's no <laughs> shortage of them. Good eating. Us or that? Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Should have run into jewels by now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. Split up? Nah, man. That's the start of a of a bad horror film right there. Take the right. We'll go left. What? Just keep your eyes open. Like, you literally have you ever seen a slasher flick, man? Like this is this is always where it goes goes pear shaped. <laughs> the moment they split up, people die. Uh, well, let's just get this over and done with, shall we? I don't like it. I want to go home. No! Jules, you son of a bitch. Jules! Get out here so I can go home. Hey! Someone there? Where you at, son? No. I'm looking to get out of this out of this swamp as quickly as possible. So, if we could if we could speed this up, that would just be fantastic. That must be him. Yeah, no doubt, man. But why do I have to go back in the swamp to find him? What are you doing, getting stuck out here, you silly fucker? Uh, uh, uh. Hey, you in a tree? <laughs> what are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. Oh, great. Well, okay I'm about to be his dinner. There's a monster. No doubt. Where? Monster, been nearly ate me. And where'd he go? It's it's out there. <laughs> what? That's real specific, a big man. Gator. Biggest I ever saw. Big and nasty. Knocked me off the boat and chased me over here. You must be Jules. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I... Oh, God. So okay. I gotta go and get the bloody boat. And, uh, where'd this monster swim off to? I 
think that way. Good luck shooting that thing. You'll need a cannon. Yeah, well, great. I'm glad that it's my responsibility. How the hell does this fall on me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just catching all your dialogue. Calm your butt down. I got the staff. It's over here. <laughs> Stuck. Watch me lose a leg right now. Oh. <laughs> you got it loose. Jump. Good man. All right. Let's get back to the dock. Yes, please. Let's go. <laughs> Post haste. going to be Gator Grub for sure. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was going to be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? <laughs> this gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. Oh, God. I think we hit a tree stump. Oh, great. You're going to need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Let, yeah, just do it. let me just guess, it's board gonna board. fall on me. This is a bad idea. No? Oh, for once it's not gonna <laughs> fall on me. <laughs> I was wrong. Got a couple crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. <laughs> you didn't see the fence. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Yeah, he definitely pulled the short straw on that one, man. Screw that. <laughs> Eve. Eve! Come on, son, put your back into it. Oh, God! I think he just lost his back. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Ah, oh, you'll go. <laughs> yep. That sounds right. That sounds about right. Alright, come on. Arthur, time is of the essence. Come on, bud. Okay, okay, I'm going, I'm coming. You got two legs, you'll be fine. Pull out a gun? Oh, we can pull out a gun. What have I got? Schofield. All that. Anyway. Come here, son. Oh, Lord. No, 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 no. I want to go home. I've had enough. <laughs> yeah, man. Nah, like, will you come and jump in the water? Come and help me out, man. Oh, no. Come, come, and brother. I got you, Sim. Hey. Arthur Strong, boy. Lifting this guy, wading through the, the thick swamp. That takes some serious strength. Oh, God, no. Ah! No. <laughs> Run, Arthur. Ah! <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm going as fast as I can, man. Trust. <laughs> you gotta trust. Oh, he was leaking out blood now. It looked like he's leaking blood. That's just what we need. Keep shooting, Dutch. Come on, son. Oh, God. No, 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 no. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm running out of stamina, though. I'm trying now, I'm literally come killing here. myself doing this. Come on! Come on, come on, come on. Oh. I thought we were done for. Oh god. Finish that son of a bitch, Arthur! You got it. Gonna have to tell me twice. Pump it full of lead till it's dead, baby. Go and look at the size of that thing. Keep shooting. Oh, no. 
I've written this mark before, but it isn't now. We want to get as many shots into it as possible. Get away, you giant thing! No! No! Bad data. I think he's going. Shit! I bloody hope so. <laughs> Pumped about 20 shots into the thing. Oh, he was bleeding. No wonder the thing was after us. God damn. Just thank your old uncle Other way is it? I heard that. There we go. Come on, we got this. Oh, that's nasty. That's gonna leave a mark. <laughs> oh God, poor bastard. I think he'll be okay if he don't get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Look oh, is the, is the thing coming back? Are you literally serious? Uh, running out of bullets on that, okay. You got it, bud. Oh, we can go dual wielders, I guess. Yeah, dead eye. <laughs> oh, no more dead eye. Ooh, do we get <laughs> Is it under the boat? What's going on? Okay. I think it's had enough. I bloody hope so. Literally be about three dozen shots are pumped into its head now. You're gonna be okay, kid. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and mad. That's unusual. Normally the little one's angry. Big ones is lazy. I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, we weren't in the water with. <laughs> I think we're all cacking ourselves. I mean, let's just be real. Can we get some help? No need for bravado. That was some, uh, that was some scary stuff. <laughs> he's been bitten, but he's alive. Just keep him warm. Largely he's thanks to me. Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. Ah, oh, so we're taking the um, taking a fight to Angelo Bronte. Kill some good folks. That's gonna be exciting. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. Mm -hmm. I'll see you soon. Be safe. Got Apart, muscles, I think. Apart from anything, he's always calling us bloody inbred hillbillies and... Oh yeah, saying we get down with farm animals and all sorts of things. Despicable man is Angelo Bronto. Oh, so, right, it's loaded us at, uh, at a camp. It's kind of different. That was a pretty, pretty spooky mission, man. I thought we were going to be gator food for sure. That, um, yeah, that had me on the edge of my seat, no doubt about it. Um, if you enjoyed seeing me almost get torn to shreds, please slap the like button down below. And if you want to see more content like this, new around here, like Red Dead, also consider subscribing. All those things really do help out the channel a lot, more than you could possibly, possibly know. Um, but yeah, till next time, folks. I am Red Nitrate. Stay legendary, everyone. Bye now.